Join the Birmingham Lutheran community for our Lenten devotions, celebrating the 250th anniversary of the hymn Amazing Grace. Hi, I'm Stan Weir, and today's lesson is the power of grace. Christ said to me, my grace is sufficient for you, for power is made perfect in weakness. So I will boast all the more gladly of my weaknesses so that the power of Christ may dwell in me. 2 Corinthians 12, verse 9. Paul prayed that his deep affliction, which he called a thorn in the flesh, might be taken away from him. Instead, Christ called him to trust the grace he had been given as power enough over any and all weakness. It was, for Paul, a reminder of the gospel. Christ put his weakness and death on public display on the cross. Yet the cross is the very power and wisdom of God because we receive mercy and grace through it. Paul would boast only of his weaknesses as the power of Christ within him even in the face of criticism, persecution, and humiliation. We too, in our weaknesses, put all our hope in the crucified Christ. Even the scars of our weaknesses bear witness to this hope. God's strength and wisdom in our crucified and risen Lord far outweigh all the strength and wisdom of the world. Let us pray. Lord Jesus, in all our weakness, may we trust that you will fill us with your grace and power. Join us live at one of our locations for Sunday School and worship, or worship virtually with First Lutheran Church on our Facebook or YouTube channel. You are always welcomed into our family.